circuit boards, eight brand new CPUs, a dozen power connectors, and one double cheeseburger with extra pickles. There's not many things I miss about Earth, but this is one of them. Enjoy. Ugh, not now. Really? What do you got? A remote air traffic monitor just triggered an alert. There it is. Pilot of unidentified high altitude balloon, you might want to check your trajectory. You're wandering awfully close to the Southern Alps. Attention, pilot of high altitude balloon, you need to pull up. Repeat, pull up. Are you reading me? <laughs> Let's be what is this? Virgil, are you still there? Friends. I think we have a situation. Helium filled, one of a kind. I can think of only one person who'd spend that much on a big balloon just for fun. Ah, oh, Francois Lemaire. If we had a frequent rescue program, he'd be gold status by now. Lemaire, this is international rescue. Do you read me? Lemaire. There it is again. This automated message keeps popping up every time I try and contact the balloon. I don't like the look of that thing. We need to get on board. That balloon's over New Zealand's southern Alps, practically our backyard. It won't take long for Thunderbird 1 to reach him. All right, I'm on my way. F-A-B. F-A-B. R-A-D. R-A-D? That's my catchphrase. Remember? It's... Never mind. Keep trying to contact Lemaire, Thunderbird 5. I'll intercept him. Hopefully he's just asleep at the wheel. and channels and never anything to watch. Am I right? What? No, it's Le Maire and this silly balloon of his. Normally he can't wait to get his face on the news and brag about his latest adventure. But I don't see him anywhere. I need to look into this. R.A.D. Touch a line and then drag it clear of the valley. I got some serious turbulence up here. It's going to hit that mountain. Taking a piece of action. Just a couple more 
Too many of my followers calling in. Yeah, so I switched to broadcast only. Hi. No, it's no good. Your altitude adjusters, they're shot. Yeah, I think I broke those. Then I thought, hey, Brandon, this is a balloon, right? Just let it float free, man. What's the worst that could happen? I don't know, you could hit a mountain. Oh, yeah. Apart from that, though. I'm Brandon Berenger, he's Scott Tracy, and this is Totally Wild. Oh, brace yourself, kid. Safety belts. Ready? We are in for an emergency landing. Stand by. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, intense. 
We totally crash into the mountain. Oh, we're rocking. We're rocking. Hey, take it easy. We're right on the edge here. Yeah, man. We are on the edge. No, I mean we're on the edge of the... Never mind. This ridge is unstable. We're going to need an extraction. Hey, Brandon here. This is so cool. Me and Scotty are like exactly the same. Thrill junkies, man. <laughs> yeah, I think the kid's right, bro. We're like two peas in a pod. Yeah, well, this pea wants out of this pod and off of this mountain, so if you wouldn't mind. Okay, hang tight. I'm on my way. F-A-B. <laughs> Climbing, Brandon. Hook, hook, hook. Yeah, just nod. Mm, yep. Yeah. Keep moving, Brandon. Uh, it's just going to t -t take five here, okay? No, don't fall asleep. Brandon, do not fall asleep. You want to tell me what I'm looking at? It's activated by voice recognition. All you need to say is deploy. Deploy? Oh, and remember to step back quickly before it opens up. Yeah. Thanks for the tip, Brains. Awesome. Whoa, this thing is crazy. 
What does it do? It is designed to make rapid descents over difficult terrain. Uh, brains, this thing only seems to have one seat. Oh, yes. Did I forget to m mention that? Uh. Cozy, I like it. I really need to get off this mountain. Now, Scott, as you haven't used the rat before, I'm going to talk you through the controls for first. It works like a gyroscope mounted on a gimbal. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a case of learn on the job, Brains. Engage internal stabilizers. Oh, 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 that's better. Test run a success. R.A.D. Brains. R.A.D. Scott. Hey, you said it. High five, Max. Whoa. Hey, Scott. What happened to your number one fan? <sighs> Feeling a little motion sick, I think. This hardware was all for me. Uh huh. Oh man. I swear it won't happen again. I'm really sorry I borrowed Mr. Lemaire's balloon. You can tell him yourself. Oh, hello, boss. Um, sorry about like. Everything. He has only one thing to say to you after pulling a crazy stunt like that. You're promoted to chief test pilot. What? Mr. Lemaire recognizes a fellow adventurer when he sees one, Brandon. Oh, awesome! This is off the hook! Let's go back to my boss's yacht and celebrate. You think this rad rad ball can work on water? F.A.B., dude! I don't think he heard me. Scott? Scotty? I'm just going to talk to him. This is nice. We should invite that kid over. That would drive Scott up the wall. Exactly. Hey, Brandon. How'd you like to ride with me? In Thunderbird 2? Epic! So you're Virgil, right? Cool. I'm Brandon Berenger. You probably heard of my vlog, Big Extreme. It's got quite a lot of followers. I say quite a lot. I mean millions. I'm pretty cool. I thought, hey, Brandon, the coolest thing ever would be to travel the Thunderbird. Take long for Thunderbird 1 to reach him. All right, I'm on my way. FAB. FAB. 
R-A-D. R-A-D? That's my catchphrase. Remember? It's... Never mind. Keep trying to contact Lemaire, Thunderbird 5. I'll intercept him. Hopefully he's just asleep at the wheel. on a big balloon just for fun. Ah, oh, Francois Lemaire. If we had a frequent rescue program, he'd be gold status by now. Lemaire, this is International Rescue. Do you read me? Lemaire. There it is again. This automated message keeps popping up every time I try and contact the balloon. I don't like the look of that thing. We need to get on board. That balloon's over New Zealand's southern Alps. Practically our backyard. thousand channels and never anything to watch. Am I right? What? No, it's Le Maire and this silly balloon of his. Normally he can't wait to get his face on the news and brag about his latest adventure. But I don't see him anywhere. I need to look into this. R.A.D. Just a couple more seconds. 
Cowboys. Try something else. Don't do anything stupid down there, Scott. Define care package inbound, Thunderbird 5. Copy that, Virgil. You've got six replacement circuit boards, eight brand new CPUs, a dozen power connectors, and one double cheeseburger with extra pickles. There's not many things I miss about Earth. But this is one of them. Enjoy. Ugh, not now. Really? What do you got? A remote air traffic monitor just triggered an alert. There it is. Pilot of unidentified high altitude balloon, you might want to check your trajectory. You're wandering awfully close to the Southern Alps. of high altitude balloon. You need to pull up. Repeat, pull up. Are you reading me? <laughs> Let's what is this? <laughs> Virgil, are you still there? Friends. I think we have a situation. Helium filled, one of a kind. I can think of only one person who'd spend that much on a big balloon just for fun. Ah, oh, Francois Lemaire. If we had a frequent rescue program, he'd be gold status by now. Lemaire, this is international rescue. Do you read me? Lemaire. <laughs> there it is again. This automated message keeps popping up every time I try and contact the balloon. I don't like the look of that thing. We need to get on board. That balloon's over New Zealand's southern Alps, practically our backyard. It won't take long for Thunderbird 1 to reach him. All right, I'm on my way. F-A-B. F-A-B. R-A-D. R-A-D? That's my catchphrase. Remember? It's... Never mind. Keep trying to contact Lemaire, Thunderbird 5. I'll intercept him. Hopefully he's just asleep at the wheel. and channels and never anything to watch. Am I right? What? No, it's Le Maire and this silly balloon of his. Normally he can't wait to get his face on the news and brag about his latest adventure. But I don't see him anywhere. I need to look into this. R.A.D. Got 
visual on the balloon. Internal lights look to be on, but Lemaire's still not answering. Comms could be down or he might be hurt. I'm going to attach a line and then drag it clear of the valley. <laughs> Yacht. In a Force 10 storm. 